All right, this will be how to transfer your contacts and files on your Samsung Galaxy A54 5G. So first what you wanna do is swipe up here, go to your contacts app, hit these three little bars here, and you're gonna see something called manage contacts. So we're gonna tap manage contacts, and now you'll see you can import contacts, export contacts, move contacts. So if we go to move contacts, allow, you can see we can select from either our phone, which we have no contacts on, or from our SIM card, which we do have these um, contacts on. So we can select all of these and we can hit done. And then we can move that to our phone. And if it so happened to be, you know, the opposite, in which case we have our phone and we're switching uh, it to our SIM card, we can do that same process. So what would happen is you'd have your phone would have been selected in the previous menu and you would see SIM here. And in that case, you can just select that and then you'd press move and that'll move your contacts. We don't really need to do that for this video, but that is how it is done. Next, we're gonna look at transferring files. Now there's a couple different ways to do this. I'll show you probably the most straightforward way of doing this. Um, oop, we're gonna swipe up here. We're gonna go to our Samsung folder. It may be in its own folder elsewhere, but we're gonna look for an app here called My Files. Now, you can also use the search bar here at the top. I'm upside down, so it's a little hard to type, but you could also search for files and that would come up. We're just gonna go here though to My Files. And now you can see a couple things here when we first go here. So for storage, we have our internal storage SD card. Here's some cloud storage options. Um, but let's go into our internal storage as we actually have data there and neither of these cloud options are set up and we have no SD card inserted. But let's go to internal storage. Let's go to our downloads. We happen to have one item and it just looks like that's a folder. Now let's say hypothetically we wanted to move this folder. So we press and hold on this and you can see one is selected. If you do have multiple files here, you will have an option to select all. Um, and next, you, what you'll do is at the bottom here, you have a move button. You tap that, and now you can move this folder anywhere you want. So we had it in downloads. We could move that to DCIM, documents, wherever we want. Let's just say we're gonna put that in documents. All you do is confirm that this is the path you want it to follow. So it's going from wherever you had it in your internal storage into your documents folder. And you tap move here, and that will move your files. Um, now, also, if you do happen to have an SD card inserted or anything, you will see the options to also transfer your files there. Um, that's effectively the easiest way to move files. There might be some other files, apps, and whatnot, but this will be the standard one that'll be on your device, and this will be the most straightforward.